Aloha and welcome to this overview of the Q2N 4K web camera made by a company called Zoom. No relation to the Zoom software that we're using for web conferencing. This Zoom web camera is mounted on a tripod, a lightweight tripod, and it's connected through cabling to a power supply and to the computer. You should not have to disconnect any of these cables. When the computer is turned on, it will run power and data to the web camera. Looking at the back of the camera, there are three flat buttons. The button on the left is the power on button. It has a power symbol next to it. If you press it and hold it for one second, the camera should turn on. Because it's connected to the computer, it will default to webcam mode. The red button in the center is commonly used to enter commands and make selections and the button to the right with the X is an exit button so you can exit menus using the exit button to turn off the camera you hold down that power button and it will turn off the camera one of the benefits to having this light tripod and small camera in your hybrid classroom is that you can position the camera closer to your students. Having the microphone and camera closer to your students enables it to better capture their comments and questions and facial expressions and communicate them to your remote students. To begin using the web camera, you first need to unlock the technology cabinet at the front of the classroom. The cabinet is locked with a combination padlock you can get the combination from your division secretary. Next, you will need to start the computer. If you're facing the computer, reach behind the lower left corner of the computer and feel for an indented button. Gently press it for about one or two seconds until the computer starts. Now you are ready to launch the Zoom application on your computer. On this particular computer, the Zoom application has an icon on the dock. When you launch Zoom, you may be asked to sign in to it. Sign in to your Zoom account using the Google Sign On button, and you can use your UH username and password. When prompted, sign in with your full UH email address. Zoom will recognize it as being a UH Google account and will take you to the UH Google authentication page. Sign in with your UH username and UH password. You will then be prompted for dual authentication. You will then be prompted to open the Zoom application. Once you open the application, you will find that you are in your Zoom account and then you can join a Zoom session or create a new one. You now have the option to select your audio and video source. You may wish to check that you are using the correct microphone. To do that, in the lower left corner, go to the carrot icon to the right of the mute microphone icon. A menu will pop up. On that menu, you can see which microphone is currently checked off and in use. The Q2N 4K web camera is the tripod mounted video camera. For the video source, you will follow a similar process. There is a carrot icon to the right of the camera icon. When you click on the carrot icon, a video menu will pop up and you will look at the various video input sources available and ensure that there is a check mark next to the video source that you would like to use. 